Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we're going to be back with Iter Tools. And this one I think is pretty cool. It kind of wraps up everything we've been learning about. So all right, let's just jump at it. Iter Tools. All right. So and it's cycle. So help. Iter Tools. Uh, cycle. So, all right. <clears throat> what this does takes an iterable, and it will uh, cycle through it, and then repeat the sequence. So, goes until it's exhausted, then repeat the sequence. So, I have a perfect example for this. So, all right. Let's take a list of students. Oops, oops if I copy. So all right, so we have a list of students. Then let's say we want to put them um, on teams. And of course, this would work better with larger, but I wanted you to be able to see all this. So all right, we're going to make a list comprehension of this, but we're going to make an iterator first so num and what this does is this is how I want you to think about it it will do this over and over and over and over again and I'll show you so all right um, num equals uh, how to do this oh yeah tools dot cycle range so one and two. So I just want one and two to be repeated over and over and over again. So all right, teams. And the way that I did this, so I have an iterator. Here, let me get rid of this. So all right, num is an iterator. And right now, so if I do next on num, I get one. Then I do next on num again, I get two. Next on num again, goes back to one. So it's not your standard iterator that goes until it's exhausted. It will then repeat itself. So, all right, now. All right, so we got that. It's just going to go over and over and over and over again. So this won't be your measure, your what you iterate through. It will be that. So all right, we have teams. Then we're going to create tuples of next num and student for student I didn't even look let's make sure and I should be clear for student in students all right let's make sure I close this out and let's print out team so okay so all right so Matt's on team one Steve's on team two Bob's on team one Sam's on team two John's on one Joe's on two so let's look at this a different way. So okay, there's an easier way to say it. One, two, one, two, one, two. And there we go. So I think this is a pretty cool one. And I did not want to forget it because this kind of wraps up everything that we've been learning about. So all right, that is that. Thanks for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if, if this is the type of video you like. And if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell because we don't want you, want you missing anything. And please leave my absolute favorites. Any comments, questions, or my absolute favorite, any video requests below because that really helps me take this channel in the way that it needs to be for you to help you. So, all right. Thanks for watching as always, and we'll see you next time.
Bye, guys.